Hello and welcome to the roundup of this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine, published on Friday, 16 September 2022. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly senior writer Cameron McKay reveals that drones will make their debut as the Africa Aerospace and Defence Expo makes a post-COVID return. Unmanned aerial vehicles and drones will for the first time be flown at the upcoming 2022 Biennial Africa Aerospace and Defence Expo, while the attendance of private sector oil and gas, mining and energy companies will represent a significant presence. The engineering news features focus on aerospace, where the industry perseveres despite a turbulent period and municipal infrastructure and services, where municipalities struggle to address key infrastructure challenges. The Mining Weekly features focus on mining in Zambia, where tripling Zambia's copper output is seen as an ambitious but attainable best case scenario. And Pumps, where a company rebrands as it evolves. This week's business leader is Mile Sofijanik, MD of ECS Associates. And as this week's cartoon shows, a recent global initiative against transnational organized crime report showed that at least 183 infrastructure and construction projects in South Africa worth more than 63 billion rand were disrupted by the so-called construction mafia in 2019 alone. Unless they are brought under control, they pose a serious threat to any infrastructure-led recovery gaining momentum. We hope you enjoy this week's edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly. Be sure to subscribe to the magazine that offers you in-depth news about developments in the real economy by emailing subscriptions at engineeringnews.co.za. Happy reading and see you next time.